here we are in our taxi on our way to the hotel in Bangkok, Thailand. We just arrived around 6 o'clock Bangkok time, which would be about 5 in the morning back in New York. Our hotel is right in the heart of Chinatown, as you can see. And can you believe I stayed here for less than $20 a night? For less than $20 a night, you get this beautiful room. It has its own gym. You have customer service and an amazing view from the roof, which I'll show you just a little bit later. The downside is there's no windows, but I'm fine with that. So here we are, we are at Koh San Road. I just landed a little while ago, went right to the hotel. I quickly just like shower changed because I heard this is a great place. We're all here for like, I guess in a sense do the same thing, which is have a good time and enjoy Thailand. <laughs> Thailand we're on the rooftop of my hotel with this beautiful view it has everything you can think of it's got a pool a gym overlooking the downtown city I think if you look hard enough you can see some of the floating markets in the background what's gonna happen is I'm gonna get some breakfast down some street food and then we're gonna try to catch a tuk-tuk to a temple or um, one of the floating markets. Thanks. So I just left the hotel. I'm making a right on the first street that I saw. And what do you see? A never ending market. I mean, I've seen these on TV, but up close, there's nothing like it. There's just food everywhere. Okay, so here we are. We landed up some main off of one of the main streets in the market. But it seems like we found some really great buildings or architecture or temples. I'm not quite sure what they are, but here you can have a look for yourself. Bangkok is an overpopulated city and they're really cramped for space as you can see here we are on a side marking street barely three inches wide and a guy's just coming through on a motor moped that's just regular lifestyle in Bangkok here we are I've hopped another tuk tuk after going to a local market and we're headed to water room Tour down the canal here. 
it's like each river has its own little street. Right now we're going through a small underpass to head to Wataroon and we're gonna see a couple of the palaces. Okay, so here we are, we're at the top of our hotel, just overlooking Bangkok, as you can see. Um, this morning we were at the floating market. Um, we're getting ready to head out into the city to go see their biggest mall, which is their center mall. And then we're gonna see what the night has in store for us. So here we are in the back of another tuk tuk. We're heading to Central World, which is their biggest mall. I mean, it's a hotel, and I think it's like about eight stories. But we're gonna see when we get when we get there. But as you know, <laughs> any trip in a tuk tuk is an adventure. Here we are at the MBK Center, which is their biggest shopping mall. It's eight stories high as soon as i got there i think i was just overwhelmed by the stores and being outside must have really drained me after walking around for 20 minutes i was beaten headed home to see more from my trip to thailand including day two and three when we go to phuket go to this huge market possibly try some insects as food and to see a music concert make sure to like comment and subscribe until then it was fun traveling with julian the second